Okay, my lovies, I got a dynamite word, freeing word, gotta say it right away word, impactful, all the above. Put my car in park. I'm waiting on an order right now. I'm in the middle of door dashing, and it's just smacking me so hard. There are so many people confused, guys, and it's so, 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 so sad within New Age versus Christianity. Within New Age versus, oh my gosh, all these cars are, of course, coming. Look at the devil, yo. He's always so busy trying to block it pulling over somebody's house. Um, there's all these different belief systems floating around the world right now, guys. And it's so, 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 so sad because there are people who believe you cannot, look at that, three cars just happen to be coming down the road that I'm trying to stop at. Um, you can't be like that, guys, because at the end of the day, we, we have to, I'm sorry, I'm so overwhelmed. I'm trying to get this word out. We have to get to a place where even if we can't find a church, look at me yesterday. I was sad about my church, duh. However, it didn't change that I needed to worship. I could feel it. I needed to talk about what God had told me. I had to do that. So with that being said, guys, we need to know that God is right here. He's omnipresent. He's everywhere. You don't have to use a prophet to get to God. You don't have to wait for your pastor to be at church on Sunday. You don't have to use chakra. You don't have to use yoga. You don't have to use meditation. You don't have to use crystals, sound bars, tarot reading cards, Ouija boards. I don't know all these angels and entities that are angel uh, entities that are pretending to be angels and talking to you guys. Like I'm so sad for the world. I'm so sad for the world. I cry so hard for the world because y'all are lost. Y'all are lost. When I get revelation about something, I feel like I was lost too. And then I'm like, whoo, I got found. But no, like you guys are seriously lost. And the ones that aren't trying to get found, you're the saddest ones. You're the ones I pray for the most because you need to understand what you're doing is being used by the enemy who mocks God anyway. All he wants to do is copycat God. He knows he's damned to hell for all eternity. So he wants to collect as many souls to come with him. He's only tricking you guys right now to make you believe something. The devil dingles things around in front of your face and says, hey, if you do this, you got to serve me. If you do this, you got to do that. And you owe me this and you owe me that. And you got to do this. God doesn't do that. He doesn't chase you around neither. Like he's going to wait on you. You choose him or you don't. So guys, with all that being said, I need you to release all of these, the signs, the holding the fingers in all different ways and stuff. Like, please research this stuff. You guys don't need to just take my word for it. I wouldn't get on here and lie to you anyway, but you don't need to take my word for it. You can go and find it in scripture. You can go find it in Google. He is your best friend, unfortunately, because that's what it is. Encyclopedias and Britannicas are gone. Um, your Bible is right there. That is also your best friend. It should be your livelihood because at the end of the day, you can't depend on any truth except the truth that you you get found out, that you find out, the truth that God reveals to you. That is your truth. That is your church. That is your fellowship at times when you can't find anything else. And then you begin to pray to God. Hey, can you please send me a church? You know how bad I'm missing fellowship right now, Lord. Hey, do you want me to start my Bible study again, Lord? You know how much I'm missing fellowship. And there's more and more women coming to me saying they want Bible study. And I'm like, okay, I used to do it for the kids. I used to do it for the ladies. Let's get it doing. Let's get it popping again, Lord. But guys, I don't need to channel anything except the Holy Spirit to get that crunk. Okay? Please, stop it. The devil is playing, y'all. He's using you. He's laughing at you when you're doing this crap. That's what makes it so worse. You think he's your buddy. You think he's your friend. You think he's guiding you right. He's cracking up at you because he just won another soul. He just was able to deceive you and get you over his dumb A-word side. And there's no prosperity on his side, guys. Nothing. Nothing good comes from that cat. Not one iota of anything comes from him. And the things he's dangling in front of you don't even last. Even the things we get here from God, it's not like, he, like he's blessing us temporarily, guys. The true blessing is when we get to heaven. Okay? So please allow the Spirit to bless you. Please pay it forward. If need be, uh, I know it's need be, but if you're feeling convicted, once you listen to this, um, Zen, Sage, Incense. I've made so many videos like this before. Get rid of it all. It's all got to go, guys. It's not of God. None of that helps you get there. Jesus Christ died and he said, I leave to you the gift of the Holy Spirit. I leave it to you. It is your Gemini Cricket, if you will. Tap into your Holy Spirit. It's the only truth that you need to be worried about, okay? Besos.